but I'll speak on it. Yeah, no. Yeah, yeah. I'll speak on it. But there's other. There's I'll two pack than that. What can, we, what can we vocal in the UK? Donald Trump is racist. No one's complaining. I think a lot of people. I'm a rapper. I'm a rapper. I'll speak on shit. I hear you. There you go. I hear you. Get shit. Yeah, I hear that. So, I mean, but you just like. You like what? Like what? I don't rate nines. I don't rate nines. So I'm supposed to say, oh yeah, rate, I like nines. No, I don't rate nines. I rate Snap Capone. I rate Gigs. I rate there's, fucking Kais. I rate bad boy rappers. But in the UK, there's certain particular rappers that I do not rate. It's I hear simple. That. But there's, I use this show and say, all right, I don't feel this person. Yeah. I don't rate this person. But you're a rapper though. But. No, but exactly. I, I, I still have so a So it's not your point to open your mouth, is it? Yeah. Because you're you not a rapper. Have to be a rapper. So your opinion, opinion is irrelevant. No, that's not true. Oh, of course, of course it is. Of course I'm not. coming to get as a rapper. All right, cool. Check that's it. Not check it. Check it. Check it. Cool. Cool. You have critics. Check it. Check it. Check it. Check it. Check it. Check it. Are you? Are you? You speaking? speaking. You want to speak? Speak. That's not true. I want to hear your opinion. Thank you very much. Basically, the music scene is made out of more people than just rappers. So if you rap, you're giving your music to the world. And the reason why everyone can have an opinion is because some people pay for it. So if I pay for something, I can have a fucking opinion. If I pay for this studio, I can say who I want inside here. If I buy that light, that's my fucking light. So if I buy your music, of course I can have an opinion on it. So therefore, you've given an opinion to people that you don't even know because you've put your music in the world. So yeah, he can have an opinion. Go on, man. You finished? Ah. Uh -huh. <laughs> so what should, I would just like to know why he can't have an opinion. You come to the show, and furthermore, you've come here to have an interview with somebody who can't have an opinion on you. What's the purpose of that? What was you, what was you gonna say on, on, on the situation? I said I wanted to say it. I was just saying a fuck nines in it. That's what I'm saying. If you don't rate someone, fair enough. Like you can have that opinion, but it, it, it's the fact that you you make it like personal about that person. It is. You speak about their family members, their yeah. family members. Like Russ, for example, you spoke about his dead sister and what you're gonna do to her and stuff like that. Like I would never even want to repeat that on this platform. Like I think it's just mad disrespectful. So I I just want to know like. Why you make things so personal? Cause he's personal. He's personal, isn't it? When you, when you but, cuss but someone, someone, you want to cuss them. You want to hurt them, innit? Fake, you want to hurt them. If you send for someone, you want to send. You want to send them. You don't. You don't. When I don't do subliminals, I'm telling that. you raw. This way it is. All right, cool. Fair enough. Oh my god, bro. Oh hell no, man. What the fuck, man? Get your ass up, bro. Man, I'm telling you, man. 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 I'm telling I'm doing me. I'm, I'm doing my life. I'm, doing, I'm, I'm going through my journey. Whoever is interested, you follow that journey. Mm. If you're not interested, don't follow the journey. It's that simple. I'll be honest here. Yeah. When you know when Takashi Six Nine was running running around the US, and a lot of people were like, you know, he was dissing everyone. A lot of people were saying, if Takashi Six Nine was ever in the UK, he'll be dead within a week. Yeah, that was the talk. Everyone was like, oh, Takashi Six Nine, he could never flourish in the UK. We can never have someone like that. They'll be dead straight away. Finished. <coughs> I feel that you are probably the the closest thing we have to that. In the UK, but I think Takashi Six Nine has made money. He's got platinum record selling deal, whatever. He's he's successful. You on the other hand, like you're in the UK and you got twenty four thousand followers. You've done a couple of interviews. You're on our platform, but I don't like. Do you want to make money from it or what? Like, is this your brand? Is Remember, this what I'm an artist, for? you know. So what I, I do is my life, innit? Yeah. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. What I do behind Instagram, nobody knows. How I make my money, don't know. You know how much money I got in my account. No, I don't. So you don't. You can't question me how it was beneficial. Don't do that. Mm. Don't do that. If you don't like what, like I said, if you don't like what, I, I don't, I don't want you to follow me. I'm follow, it's my life. It's my journey. I'm gonna live yeah. how I live. It's that mm. simple. I don't, I don't follow you. I don't follow none of you. I don't follow none of you people. I don't follow nobody because I don't need to. I don't, I don't, I don't see. I don't. There's no. There, nobody teach me nothing. There's no substance. I don't know you fuckers. You let people follow. There's, no, there's what, what am I learning? I'm not learning nothing. I hear that. I'm gonna so follow someone to go about his watching bus down so, and really, so really. Out of curiosity, just for. Just for my mind, because I need to always understand things, otherwise I just get really frustrated in my head. Um, you're a rapper, so you provide a service for people, but you don't care what nobody thinks. But when you provide a service for people, you need to care what they think so you can make financial gain. Bro, nobody, so how do you, how do you, how do you, music. How, so how are you going to make money and be a rapper? Don't worry about my music, I'm not from here, I'm, I'm African, don't worry about my life. <laughs> Don't worry about my life, bro. But how you're can English, you come? You're English, how I'm you African. You're English, don't worry. How can you, how can don't you come worry. to an interview you, and say, listen, don't you, worry? You, you call me here. You call no, me I here. Call I did not invite myself. Sure, I did not call Whoever you. Whoever called oh, me, bro, oh, this I guy. Call you. I call bro, you. this I call brother. You. I call you. See what, bro, you know what? I'm I'm just, this is long, innit? I never come to my house for this, innit? I come far. No, yeah? no, I, I, Boom, I spoke to my people. I I didn't want to come. Do you understand? I didn't want to come. Boom, I came, innit? But right now, I'm just getting vexed, I'm just getting vexed, innit? It's long, innit? Oh, if I'm a problem being there, Alhan, you can have the conversation, I can go over there, bro. I have no problem. No, don't get angry. I ain't got time for this, bro. Don't get angry, bro. Look, no problem. Here, you have to, you know, it's not disrespectful. I don't disrespect nobody. Trust me, I don't disrespect nobody. I'm a very respectful person. You know what you're dealing with. You know what you're dealing with. Fredo. It's not Fredo. Bro, I don't. Listen, I understand. 
man. Straight I'm up, a very boy. respectful man. He's got two guy. kids and I'm not going to be disrespected as well. Street nigga, boy. Street Trust nigga, me. Trust me. Alhan, have your interview. I'll stand right here. Do you want no to problem. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. What's life saying? What's coming up? What projects are you working on? That nigga crazy. <laughs> to get your ass away from here with that shit.